Hey guys, on today's video, we're gonna be updating your Mac. So let's just get started. Go right on top, on your top left hand corner, you guys will see the app logo. On your app logo, just click on it. Your second option will be system preferences. With older Mac OS's, all the updates used to be on the App Store. So if you're on older Mac OS, go into your App Store. For those of you who are up to date, let's just go into system preferences. Under system preferences, we will see down here below in our third option where it says software update. Just click on software update. And then we should see this popping up. It might take a little bit of time to load up. Don't worry about it. You guys will see it. You guys can get more information just by clicking right here and we can see exactly what happens. So before we go on and do this update, which is really quick, it's less than a gig. It's only 985.4 megabytes. Let's just close this up. And before we hit that, I'm gonna ask you to make a backup of your Mac. I suggest using Time Machine. So I have Time Machine set up right here. And I can just press backup now. And Time Machine is something that's pre-built into your Mac. I have a separate video showing you guys how to set up Time Machine, how it works. But basically it backs up your entire Mac. So if for any reason this update screws up your Mac, you guys have a way out of it. So, and that's the easiest way, by the way, to back up all your apps, documents, photos, everything from your Mac, even the OS itself. So let's just go ahead and click on update. This will restart on Mac. So we will see an Apple logo, a loading bar, and this update itself will take about, well, for most of you, a gig will take around 20 minutes with slowish internet. And then with those of you who have faster internet, well, you're looking about five to 10 minutes. 10 minutes, again, would be stretching it out, but with really, really, really fast internet, just five minutes should be good enough downloading and installation of this update. Don't forget to make that backup just in case. So let's just hit on update now. We're gonna hit on download and restart, and it's gonna start the downloading process. So don't worry if it tells you one hour because you might change to this, four or eight minutes remaining, it all depends on your internet speed. And as you guys know, internet speed can vary. So you guys can start off really fast and then go really slow. After this is done, you will get a pop-up saying that it's gonna restart. You guys can restart it later. However, make sure you're not doing anything important on your Mac at this point, because it might just restart once you guys go and grab a cup of coffee and come back, it could restart by itself. So just have everything close and all good to go. Anyway, since I can't really record the part where you guys get a black screen, Apple logo, a loading bar, and then just restarts and you're done with your update, that would be it for this video. But that's the process that you will see. Apple logo, loading bar, and you're done. Anyways, that's it for this video tutorial. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write it down here in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.